I want my presence to be known I'm being real, I'm just being known Okay, so I am back home and like I did a little bit of running around. I did not pick up no batteries for my tree. Oh my God. But anyway, as y'all can see, the decorations has fallen. Like even this one, it fell over here and it fell completely down all the way over here. Like, so I don't know what I'm going to use to put them back up there. But right now I just got home. It's kind of a little tight, ain't gonna lie. I've been up. I had to run my brother somewhere. What's crazy? I was just looking for this tripod. But I had to run. I had to run my brother. Why is it looking like that? Like super orangey. Okay, so I had to run my brother somewhere. And I've literally been up since I got out like I got up like around 7 30, 8 o'clock, I think. So yeah, so like I said, today I'm going to be cooking. I was supposed to be making um, lamb, smothered lamb, mashed potatoes, uh, string beans, and gravy. This is the one I just do not like, this tripod. But anyway, um, I went to Dollar General, didn't have any milk. I wasn't trying to go like all the way to a grocery store. Like I just wasn't. But I did pick this up from Dollar General, y'all. When I tell y'all Dunkin' Donuts coffee creamer, is is that for real? Like it shits on. To me, Starbucks creamer does not have anything on um, the Dunkin' creamer. Like I feel like the Starbucks creamer is nasty to me. Like I don't know why I just can't get with it, but it's just not good to me. But yeah, so I picked that up. So my lamb is marinating in there. It smells so good. Too. My meat has been marinating overnight. And then I got my little glass pan. They got a water stain in there. But I'm just gonna put that on there. Oh, that smells so good. Now I'm looking like steak, but it ain't. <laughs> well, it's gonna be so good. It smells so good too. So yeah, that's how it's looking. And then I'm gonna try to go um, cut up a bell pepper.
Come and put you inside a D-Class That's just a start of it Plenty things kind of life But none of them is a thought of it New piece around my neck is chess games Can shorty stay with calculated moves Like Beth Harmon Swear I'm on purple rain Prince than Prince Charming Disappointment I stay expecting it The pessimist gold man Okay <laughs> Okay So my mashed potatoes are done I don't know if they look too good But they done. I like more like a clunkier mashed potato. So they're done. Let me actually go and get. Come on now. Damn. Okay. So I got that cover in it. And then now we're going to move on to the gravy. Y'all, I never made gravy a day in my life. So y'all are going to be here. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know how to brown, but y'all going to be here to help me through it. All right. So, I went to my grandma's house and I got some, uh, what's the name? Some flour. And then I got a little bit of beef flavoring because I already had chicken. <laughs> so, I went and got some beef flavoring. So, okay. So, the lady used, she used like oil and she used butter. So, I'm using a little bit of grape, grape seed oil. Just a little bit. Not too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's butter. This is vegan butter, so I don't know if that's that'll help, but use butter. this gravy together. Little 
location turn brown after the video i did the turn get all of those clumps in your room very important when you add quarter so now you're going to add your onions this is a girl onion. we're going to add this water i slice Okay, y'all, put in the water. Baby, I don't know what this, what's okay, going on with so that. Okay. Y'all, I hope this is flour that I got, because it's literally... Cause let's see, cause I don't understand like why it's doing it. Okay, it's looking like something. It's definitely thickening up. You have to be patient, give it time. It will turn brown. As you can see here, my root is turning brown. I'm not even going to cut this clip here. I'm going to leave it just like this, speed it up a little bit, and let you guys see that. A little patient, it will turn brown. You just want to continue to mix it, mix, mix. Like, do not walk away from the skillet. You have to continue to mix. Okay? Chicken bouillon. So this is going to replace the need for chicken broth. Now I do recommend you use chicken broth, but if you do not, I don't know if this got some like bacon soda or something in here, because baby, you saying it? Or 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 chicken stock or anything like that, or beef broth. You can use chicken or beef bouillon to flavor your gravy. So now we're gonna add some water. Now we're gonna add this like straight from your water bottle you don't really have to measure this out because you want to add a small amount of water girl this ain't going water. like the, okay. the way i want it to um, like, it's looking like gravy but i don't know you want to add <laughs> okay so now y'all so i just added a little bit of the beef flavor to it and then I'm about to add a little bit of the chicken. I do like half beef, half chicken, half half of that taste. Um, because I do have lamb, so I don't know. I'm just used to my gravy tasting like chicken, so I'm gonna use this chicken bouillon stuff. But I have it in the um, in the cube. So so yeah, we're just gonna see. I hope I had it cooked. Like, you know, longer like they did, but you don't see it's a little light and ain't brown gravy in there. So, let's see, let's stick beside it, okay? Gravy for scratch. I hope it is not like gritty or nothing. I'm going to cut it down a little bit since it's already kind of cooked. I just want to add a little bit of that. A little bit more chicken bouillage. Okay. Let's see. Let's mix it again. Right now, I'm going to go and grab Set that off to the side. Grab my lamb. That's exactly what needed a little bit of garlic. Grab my lamb. Show y'all how that's pretty much looking. Now go my piece of lamb. Okay. 
And then my gravy is back here. Dip it. Okay. Let's try it out. Don't be real. This is dance number like, mm, that bitch. Yeah, you fucked up. So <laughs> I mean, it's good. I just never really tasted gravy, though. So maybe go back in with a batch of a little bit of garlic, a little bit of onion. But I don't want to mess it up. So, I mean, it's good for the most part. But I do want to um, soak, like, my pieces in here. So, I'm going to show y'all that. Let me put in my lamb. Gravy. I should have took the juice from the lamb and made the gravy. That would have been good too. But you know. Yeah, that's that on that. Everything is like looking really good. So yeah, there it goes. I don't know if it looked good from that angle, but I mean, it, it was pretty good though. So right now I'm about to bring out my other pan. And we about to work on these string beans, which is just something I should have did at first. But yeah, so I'm going to cover that with it. Yeah, so that concludes this vlog. Y'all went to brunch with me. We did a little shopping. Y'all saw me put up Christmas lights. And then y'all watched me cook me some dinners, smothered lamb, gravy, and mashed potatoes, and string beans. I gotta get out now. And these are the ones that me and Nelly, we really don't go for these, but he got these at Whole Foods, so these are the ones that we get. Girl, that's why the fucking thing hot. Child, the fire was on. It's cooking. Look, I had the fire on. Wow. Wow. Okay. That was good thing it's glass. I'm for a minute. Look who it is calling me. Like, what the fuck do you want? See, y'all saw me decorate. Y'all saw how the freaking decoration just fell. Then I still haven't, like, did the lights on the other tree. I just had to do that next week, for real, for real. Because it's not going to get done this week. I feel like I did a lot. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Please be sure to, like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. But, yeah. Stay tuned for my finished result.